can the F-21 compete with Rafale in India? Lockheed Martin is developing a new variant of the F-16 fighter to compete in the procurement tender for 110 new Indian fighter planes, reports national interest. United States companies may not rely solely on F-21 to win contracts. According to journalist Angad Singh, the possible winner was the French company Dassault Rafale's twin-engine fighter. Singh explained the reason in the May 2019 edition of Combat Aircraft. India had previously ordered 36 Rafales as part of a previous fighter tender. According to Singh, by purchasing 36 Rafales and infrastructure available for an additional 36, the cost of training, bases and maintenance for additional aircraft would not be too expensive for India. Other candidates for the Indian tender are Saab Gurpin from Sweden, Eurofighter Typhoon Europe, MiG-35 from Russia and Boeing Super Hornet from the United States. Whichever fighter is chosen, New Delhi needs a new fighter now, according to Singh. The government has agreed to increase the strength of the Indian Air Force, given the country's well-publicized security scenario and the possibility of facing the threat of a two-front combination of Pakistani and Chinese air power in the West and Northeast, is 42 combat squadrons, Singh wrote. There is little clarity about how this exact figure was obtained, but even so, the IAF has not matched this power for two decades, and has never approached a force fully equipped with modern warplanes. In 2019 the Indian Air Force maintained only 30 squadrons of fighter aircraft. Operating units include 244 older 1960s MiG-21 fighter aircraft and 84 MiG-27 units that are only slightly younger. MiG-21, in particular, is accident prone. Since the first of 874 MiG-21 jets entered Indian service in 1963, around 490 of them fell, killing around 200 pilots. Now New Delhi wants to spend around 18 billion US dollars to get 110 new fighters to replace the old MiG. The new planes will fly with European-made Jaguar, Mirage 2000 and French Rafale, Russian MiG-29 and Su-30 and Indian original Tejas fighter planes in what Lockheed describes as the largest fighter ecosystem in the world. For the purposes of marketing campaigns, Lockheed said the F-21 is a new fighter, although it has many of the same main features as the F-16V which has been sold to Bahrain, Greece, Slovakia, South Korea and Taiwan. Lockheed can build a new F-16V or upgrade an older F-16 to the V standard. The F-16V or F-21 is a fighter that is very different from the F-16A which first flew in 1978. The old F-16A was a nimble, 8-ton fighter plane with unsophisticated radar and short-range weapons. While the F-16V weighs 10 tons, has sophisticated radar and other sensors and carries a variety of long-range weapons, and all are very maneuverable. Lockheed initially implied that India could enter the F-21 acquisition with a separate purchase of the F-35 stealth fighter. The F-21 has similar components and lessons learned from Lockheed Martin's fifth-generation F-22 and F-35 fighter jets and will share a common supply chain on various components, Lockheed said on his website on February 20, 2019. A few hours later, the claim was lost from the site. Although Lockheed was tempting in secret, the French Rafale might be at the forefront of the Indian fighter contest. Thank you for watching my channel. This video is just an illustration. I hope you can understand it. Thank you my friend.